You know, there are tens of thousands, if not hundreds of thousands, different types of plastics in the world that could theoretically be used for our plastic components. But since we have such a, a focus on robustness, we tend to focus on the materials or the different types of plastics with uh, the most compelling strength characteristics, robustness characteristics, with chemical resistance being one of those. And it's not on price, it's not on convenience, it's not on logistics, it is on performance. That's how we you know, identify the materials that we're going to use. The challenge given to us is to develop the smallest form factor battery for the R7. And so we need to take a consumer technology, the latest cell technology, like the lithium polymer battery, and fit into and make the battery as robust as what we have for other radios. These cells have higher energy densities, and uh, with that comes longer talk time, so they don't have to charge it all the time. Whether it's waterproofing, dust proofing, or you know, uh, four foot drop, all those, uh, so those are the technology and robustness we bring. Not only it looks small, but it feels small and it feels good. What's really unique about R7 is that we were able to pack a lot of updated technology into a slimmer form factor. So we learned from our research that our customers didn't really care about the height of the product so much. It was more how thin the product is for a perfect grip and for good wearability. We have doubled up the viewing area with a larger display. And then we have basically totally renovated, if you want, innovated our user interface itself, um, and also made some modifications on the mechanical piece of the keypad. So it feels different, looks different, should be easier to interact with. That home screen becomes that really important piece where you should be able to get information at a glance. So we really focused a lot of our effort on that home screen and the menu. Everything else, they're very comfortable with where they need to go, but they're getting that information surfaced at the top, so now they don't have to navigate all the way down to that information, but if they needed to, they know how to do so. When you're designing for you know, the general public, what you're really designing for is to keep them engaged in your application. Our end users are very different. They are using our devices to get a job done. Their job is not playing with our devices. So the faster they can get to the information that they need and get back to their job, the better it is for them.